What's up cousins? In this video I'm going to talk about how to handle UI events similar to using on-click listeners in the old view system but using Jetpack Compose. The code samples are available in the article linked below. Sealed classes are perfect for modeling UI events among other kinds of events. Let's start by creating a sealed class by asking a very simple question for each part of your app's UI. What are all the different ways which the user can interact with this? For example, looking at the screen of my app here, Graph Sudoku, this is what my sealed class looks like. Any event which does not need a value is made into an object. Any event which needs one or more values is made into a data class. Next, we need an event handler function. Whichever class handles the presentation logic of this part of the UI should possess this function. This would be your presenter, controller, or view model, depending on what architecture you're using. I use my own architecture because I don't find three-layer architectures like MVP or MVVM alone to be suitable for complex mobile user interfaces, but use whatever you like. I generally have both a presenter and a view model. In any case, whatever you choose, create an event handler function like in this class here. Naturally, we need some way for our composables to get a hook to this event handler function. Kotlin function types are perfect for this. In your composable, be sure to define a function type as a parameter and make its argument or parameter your sealed class. In whatever you use as a context for this composable, here I am using an activity, you can use a function reference. This can be done by typing the name of the class which has the function, which is my presentation logic class here, followed by the name of the function without any brackets or arguments. You will need the two colons, and if you're typing in a top-level function, you can obviously omit the class name first. To use this function type inside of a composable, you will need to pass the type, the function type, down to each composable which has some kind of UI interaction. Some composables like button have an on-click parameter, and you can just set it equal to a lambda expression, and then call your event handler within that lambda. Also, sometimes you need to use the clickable modifier in order to get your on-click, but after that you can do exactly the same thing. If you like this video, like the video, and consider subscribing. Also, if you like Sudoku, consider downloading the app. Thanks for watching. Peace out, cousins.